you want to be the best pianist of all time? Do you want to win all gigs just with your fingers? It is easy as pronouncing Do Re Mi Fa Sol La Ti Do. Play like a pro with Emmanuel Lugue. Subscribe, drop a comment and share with your friends. Yes, hello guys. Welcome so much for this uh today's lesson and this is Emmanuel Lugo of course, uh, your best online piano tutor from Kenya. Now, if you are here for the first time, you can please subscribe, uh hit the notification bell so that tomorrow or next time I produce a new lesson, you are the first person to be notified. Also, you can like and share this video if you find it more interesting. All right. So today we are looking at diminished chords how to form them i'm sure we've looked at that uh so many times but uh in few days we've been looking at how to uh to use the diminished chords now uh what are diminished chords and how do we form them last time we looked at how we can form major minor and diminished and uh we looked just a bit on how we can form uh the diminished chords now in this lesson i'm going to show you Uh I'm going to show you how we can form the diminished chords and where we can use them. Where we can we can use them in our playing. I'll do it in several keys so that most of you can understand. Now, for instance, I'm in the key of C. This is the key of C. I'm having a C E and G. C E and uh and G. So this is my 1, 3 and 5. Now, we said we form Maj uh sorry diminished chords by playing the root flat fifth flat third and flat fifth of the major scale so you need also to understand the major scale of the certain key that you want to form its diminished chord so we form uh diminished chords by playing the root flat third and flat fifth so this is the third and this is the fifth in the key of c those who play in the key of c i can sure they understand this and uh, we flatten the third and the fifth so that we can make it a diminished chord a diminished chord so that we can make it a diminished chord so this is one flat third and flat fifth of the c major scale all right so um that is how we form the diminished chords now one thing i want you to understand is that when i say a c diminished chord does not mean that we use it in the key of c when i say f sharp diminished chord does not mean that i'm using it in the key of f sharp it is being used somewhere else as a passing chord as a passing chord because mostly diminished chords they don't make sense if they they are being played as a standalone chord but they play a very good role as passing chords as passing chords So we form diminished chords by playing the root flat third and flat fifth. We can look at E diminished chord just randomly. This is E major flat and third and flat and fifth. Make it diminished. We looked at how we can form diminished chords. We can form C sharp or D flat diminished chord. We can form G This is G diminished. This is a diminished this is a sharp diminished this is b diminished <clears throat> uh we have yeah this is uh a flat diminished a flat diminished we have uh f diminished f diminished we looked at diminished chords you can go through my uh, previous videos you'll find uh, a lot of lessons they have done diminished chords now i want us to look at how we can where we can use this diminished chords where we can use uh, this diminished chords where we can use the diminished the diminished chords All right. Now, uh I normally like to use diminished chords while uh going to the 6th chord. Uh while I want to go to the 6th chord, I can use a diminished chord, a diminished chord. 
Now, in the key of F sharp, so that most of you can understand. I want to go to the six. For instance, the song, You are Alpha and Omega. We worship you alone. You to be praised so we give you a the six chord while, while I want to go to the six now I will use I will go a semitone lower and use the diminished chord of this note here this is D so we form a D diminished chord D diminished chord how do we form it root so this is the, the D major scale D D major scale. So we form D major, flat and third and fifth to get a diminished chord. So we use this one as a passing chord to go to our sixth chord. So you are alpha and omega. We worship you alone. You are worthy to We give So that is where we use the chord. So in short, if you want to go to the six chord, you can use the flat six, uh, the seven and the two in any chord. Flat six and the seven and the two to go to the six. Flat six, seven and the two to go to uh, to the sixth chord to go to the sixth chord that is it very simple let's try it in the key of F so you are alpha and omega we worship you alone you are worthy to be praised we give you So flat six, this is the six, flat six, the seven, and the two. So we use this chord. This is a D diminished, D flat diminished, sorry. This is D flat diminished. So we use it as our passing chord to go to, to the six. We use it as our passing chord to go to the six. We give you. We worship you alone. You are worthy to be praised. Let's try it in the key of C. So you are Alpha and Omega. We worship you alone. You are worthy to be praised. Be praised. We don't finish with the four, but the one. We give you all the glory. We worship you alone. You are worthy to be praised. To be praised to the one. Sometimes I like finishing with the four, but it's all right. For our case, we finish with the one. So we give you all. Now, our, our six is the A minor. It's the A minor. A minor is our six. So we form uh, we form G sharp. We form a uh, A flat diminished chord as our passing chord to the A minor. So we give you the glory. We worship you alone. You are worthy to be praised. So A flat diminished to go to the six 
our passing code to go to the A minor. So diminished chords mostly we use them as passing chords to uh, the minor chords. That's how mostly I like to use diminished chords. So anytime you want to go to a minor chord, you can use a diminished chord, a semitone lower than the chord that you want to play that than your destination chord. Thank you so much, guys. We'll meet in the next lesson. Kindly, if you have any question, you can drop a comment in the comment section below. Or WhatsApp me through my WhatsApp number. It is there on the screen. You can just WhatsApp me. If you also need keyboard beats, if you also need private lessons, you can WhatsApp me as well. Thank you so much. I'll see you. Bye-bye.